Welcome to your English class. So it is a pleasure to be again with you. Good evening to all of you. Good evening, Veronica. Good evening, Carmencita. Good evening, Franklin, Katia, Renata, Marcela, Giovanni. Good evening to all of you. So I got a question. So as you know, today is St. Valentine's Day. Today is February 14. In my opinion, I don't like to celebrate some Valentine's Day. For me today, it's like it's like a normal day. Yes, I celebrate in order to, in this case, I like to celebrate with my best friends. But what represents some Valentine's Day for you? It represents something or it's not. What represents St. Valentine's Day? In my case, as I said before, I prefer to celebrate with my friends. But what is friendship? ¿Qué es la amistad? What is friendship? So let's see, I'm going to, Marcela, could you please turn on your audio? Thank you, Marce. Hello, teacher. So, Marce, Marce do you like to Hello, celebrate teacher. some Valentine's Day? Um, in my case, um, Valentine's Day represent uh, uh -huh. and first uh, the the law is God. Uh -huh. um, the law is family and, uh -huh. and friendship. That's it. Okay, so Marce, I got a question. What does it mean? ¿Qué significa? What does it mean friendship for you? Amistad. Amistad. Yes. Aha, uh -huh. but I'm not talking about the translation. I'm talking about the meaning. It represents something for you. For example, teacher, in my case, friendship represents all my friends. I got good friends, but I always said my best friend is my mom because my mom always supports me. Yes, Marce, what represents friendship? Se prepara Giovanni. In my point of view, uh -huh. the friendship uh, represents uh, my parents and my best friends. Do you have best friends? So how many best friends do you have? One, two, three. Uh, I have two best friends. What are their names? Um, their, their uh -huh. names are um, Melvin uh, Rodriguez. <laughs> se me está olvidando. Don't worry, just Melvin <laughs> in, in what? Excuse me? Um, uh, Katia Vasquez. Okay, so the last question. Are you a good friend? Repeat, teacher. Are you a good friend? You, I'm mm. talking about you. Are you a good friend? Mm. For me, yes, teacher. I'm good and very well, friends. But my question is, you, vos, eres tú, eres tú, una buena amiga? Are you? Ah, yeah. Sorry, sorry. Uh -huh. um, I consider, yes, I'm good friend. Why? Because I try to... 
to help um, to my friends and spend time with their um, or that's it. Teacher. Ok, excelente. Los agarré en curva, ¿verdad? No, no les quise decir que vamos a tener... <risa> Muy bien, Marcia, esta conversación para que no se prepararan, para que en este caso todo lo hagan ustedes de una forma fluida. Ok, thank you. Giovanni, good evening. Welcome to your class. Um, for friendship. Yes, no, 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 please. So, no, no, olvidémonos solo. Please pay attention. So, hello, Giovanni, how are you? Good. Excellent. So, Giovanni, do you like to celebrate San Valentine's Day? Nothing. Um, tomorrow at my school, at the 18 pizza. Oh, nice. But tell me, please, do you have good friends? Yes. Why? My good friends. Uh, you carry my carry, charismatic and and cool and my respect for me excellent and you are you a good friend sorry sorry are you are you a good friend uh my friends and you Angel. no no and you I, i'm talking about you excuse me are ah, you yes, a good friend yes. why Yes, uh, respect for my friends mm -hmm. and I am uh, uh, I am charismatic. I am charismatic with them mm -hmm. uh, and. Teacher, I always uh, support my, my and I friends. Give, and, and I give them things. Okay, excellent. Thank you so much, Giovanni. Please, Giovanni, elegí una persona de la lista. Te voy a dar nombres. Verónica, Carmen, Daniela, Edward, Franklin, Katia, Renata, Kenny. Choose one student, please. Katia. Katia, excellent, thank you. Good evening, Katia. Welcome to your class. How are you? Hi, teacher. I'm fine. Okay, question number one. Do you like to celebrate some Valentine's Day? Yes, I like to celebrate this Valentine's Day with my friends or my family. Excellent. How do you celebrate it? Um, I come with uh, convivencia, how do you say? I spend time. I spend time um, um, every night eating uh, and dancing or singing with my family or with my friends. Okay. I like mm -hmm. to go, go to the restaurant to eat. Okay, so let's see. Do you have good friends? Um, in my opinion, I do consider myself a good friend because I like to support my friends and whenever they need me, I am there for them. And mm -hmm. I always try to give the best, best advice. Okay, but in this case, do you have good friends? Yes, I have a, a good friends. Why? Um, I like it. Um, go to the eat with my best friends, and I yes, love but, you, my best yeah, friends. Yes, but my question is, do you have good friends? Yes or no? Uh, yes. Why? Why do you consider they are good? Because always be with me. Mm -hmm. and my best friends eat uh, excellent friends with me. Mm -hmm. Always, always me, me visit my me. Always visit me. 
Yes, always visit me. And talking uh -huh. every night or the day. Okay, she, excellent. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, no, excuse me, tell me please. Um she is um uh, my best friend. It um she has, has been my friend for almost all mm -hmm. my life since nice. we were six years old. Okay, excellent. Thank you so much, Kathy. Please choose one student. Veronica, Carmencita, Daniel, Daniela, Edward, Franklin, Kenny, Renata. Choose one. Um, Daniela. Okay, thank you so much. Hello, Daniela. Good evening. Hi, teacher. Welcome to your class. So tell me, do you like to celebrate St. Valentine's Day? Mm, depends. Mm -hmm. Or what? Um, because it's a normal day or a business day. <laughs> yes, it is. It's, it's for you to celebrate Valentine's Day is a commercial day? Mm, yes. <laughs> Why? Because the, the friendships or the another people it, buy the or buy the another gift with her girlfriend or with with his boyfriend. Okay, so talking about love. What represent love in your life? My family and my dog. <laughs> Excellent, because most people think, Daniela, talking about love is talking about boyfriend or girlfriend, but it's not that. It isn't that, excuse me. Talking about love is, for example, the love that God gives me every day, for example. Number two, how my family loves me. Number three, how my friends love me too. But they get confused because they say, oh, okay, what is love? Okay, a love is when you got a couple. So it isn't, right? Yes. <laughs> so tell me, Daniela, because this is a conversation, Dani, it's not an interview. <laughs> it's a conversation. <laughs> so um, in this, in, uh, I don't know how can I say how can I say that, but most people believe that Valentine's Day is more commercial. But some people think that yes, it is nice to celebrate some Valentine's Day. But for me, I don't like to celebrate some Valentine's Day. But the reason is because for me, it's a normal day. It is a normal day for you too. Yes. <laughs> why? Tell me why, my goodness. <laughs> yeah, because um, for uh, the others, when well, the last years, uh, we celebrate with my on with my friends on the mm -hmm. school. But and today, now was totally and, different, right? Yes, uh, on the study and I. I uh uh I don't see. <laughs> but is is remember you can invent. Remember you can invent. Uh and is it different because no hay para recolectar la comida. <laughs> la comida. Así como antes, este, las celebraciones que se hacían antes en el colegio. <laughs> so it is different because today you are at the university, right? Yes. <laughs> they don't celebrate it? No. My God. So would you like to celebrate at the university like a playing secret friend? No. Why? Because uh, the, the people say the gift is uh, no It's a waste more... of time. It's a waste of money. Uh, yes. <laughs> the ways of money mm -hmm. 
yes and no is teacher for like me it. teacher for me i'm an adult it's irrelevant yes tell me <laughs> teacher i'm yes. an adult it's irrelevant. I'm all teacher. <laughs> I'm all teacher. Yes. O sea, lo que, please, this is a conversation. So, teacher, I'm, well, you're not old, my goodness. You're very young. So, but yeah, I got your point. But teacher, is irrelevant. Yes, it's a normal day. That's it. <laughs> Thank yes. you, Daniela. Thank you so much. Please, choose the next student. Um, a Berito. Okay. Thank you. So, let's see, Berito. What about you? Do you like to celebrate San Valentine's Day? Se prepara Franklin? No, for me it is, it is, is day to sell chocolate balloons and balloons. Mm -hmm. Balloons and roses. And roses. It, hey. mm -hmm. it is normal day, day. I prefer birthday my pet friends and more. Yes, me too. Birthday. I prefer to celebrate my birthdays, my birthdays friends, and I prefer to celebrate my Mother's Day too. The Mother's Day. In order to celebrate Valentine's Day, but are you a good friend? Mm. Do you consider mm. you, in this case, are you a good friend? Mm. Yes, uh, my best friend. No, Mary. my question is, you, Veronica, Ana Veronica, you. I'm talking about you. Mm -hmm. Are you a good friend? Mm, yes. Yes. Mm, help people where they need it. it. Okay. Excellent. So uh, now what I see. Do you have friends? Good friends? Yes, teacher. Why? Uh, good friends. Teacher, mm -hmm. listen to me. Teacher, yes, I got good friends because they always support me at any time because they are good at keeping secret, teacher, because when I feel bad, when I feel down, when I feel sick, they always visit me. That's the reason that I consider they are good friends. So why do you consider are they good friends? Um, I consider um, the um, the best friend, the best friend, mm -hmm. uh, um, the teacher, teacher, teacher friends, um, um, that's it, that's it. Mm, I think you don't understand my question, but okay, thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, don't worry about it. Please choose one student. Carmencita, Daniel. Hey, and, no, no. Ah, no, I said, I said Franklin. I said Franklin. Ah, yes, I see. Sí, I me que había elegido Franklin. Hello, Franklin. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. How are you? Uh, I'm fine, and you? I'm really good. Thank you for asking me. So let's see. Be ready, Edward. So Franklin, San Valentine's Day. My God, it represents something for you? No. <laughs> okay. Yes, but well, miren, cuando les hago una pregunta, no me diga yes, no. O sea, dígame yes o no, pero de un solo redeme el por qué la razón. My goodness. <laughs> Franklin, again, San Valentine's Day, it represents something for you? Uh, no, because mm -hmm. the San Valentine's Day is usually pass in my house with my mom. It's normal, right? Yes, it's normal. Miss it's uh, a normal day for me. Yes, it is, but... I prefer staying in my house. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, wow, nice. So in my case, I used to, yes, I used to celebrate, but no, not like nowadays, because today is totally different. For me, Valentine's Day is, is a commercial. It is a commercial day, but yes, I believe, Franklin, I believe in friendship. Yes. I believe in love. Yes, because love exists. But for me, love represents my family, my dog, my friends, 
represent the love of God, it's not just about to have a boyfriend or just to have yes. a girlfriend, right? So yes. what represent love in your life? Uh, love in my life, I represent my love, my family, my my friends, my my pets, and, and uh -huh. me. For me, it's not necessary to have to have girlfriend, but to believe in in love. Excellent. The last question: Are you a good friend? Yes, I have a good friend. No, you are uh, you? I don't know. <laughs> uh, yes, I wow. consider myself a good friend. Why? Because I I like the the help the help him. Mm -hmm. And another and to pass time with with tears or uh, <laughs> to pass time with they and the have the uh, good moment excellent okay excellent okay. thank you so much edward good evening welcome to your class thank you miss so talking about some valentine's day se prepara carmencita do you like to celebrate Yes, I like to celebrate because it's a very special day about love and friendship, and I have a lot of friends. Uh, and I today I was talking with my best friend, and I told <laughs> you him, are the you are the hey. first you are the first one that said yes, of course, teacher. I like to say <laughs> nice. Yeah. Okay, continue. Yes, I, I do not have a couple, but I had friends, and I was talking uh, today with my best friend, and I told him, hey happy friendship day we are good friends uh maybe from for eight years maybe uh -huh. yeah so it's a special day and i celebrate with my friends and with my family because i love my family mm -hmm. and uh, some people some people yeah. get get confused Edward, because they believe that san valentine's day is just when you when you got a relationship with a boyfriend when you got girlfriend but it's not but some valentine's day there are a big history at the back i i cannot explain there is the history because i read just one time but there is a history at the back so in this case talking about you talking about edward do you consider you as a friend are you a good friend well, I consider myself, um, okay, that is a hard question and I don't know how to answer that because um, I consider myself a good friend mm -hmm. because I like to help my friends when they need it, but uh, I like to do many jokes, jokes, uh -huh. heavy <laughs> jokes, and sometimes uh, they, don't, they don't like it at all. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that is a problem. But yes, I consider myself a good friend. I'm, I'm to listen to them when they need it, and I'm to help them when they need friends. If they need help. Sorry. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Excellent. Thank you. Nice participation. Thank you. Thank you, Edward. I'm going to conclude this topic with Carmencita. Dicho, yo quería participar. Si, quiere, si no participó y quiere participar, ahí me deja saber, ¿ok? So, let's see, Carmencita. Hello. Hello, teacher. Hey, San Valentín's Day. I'm a person who believes that San Valentín's Day, it isn't just represent when you got a boyfriend or when you got a girlfriend. For me, it represent my family, my friends, and how they support me at any time. So, this is my definition. What is yours? Uh, well, some Valentine's Day is a good day to celebrate love, but in different ways. Mm -hmm. For example, friendship, uh, family, um, um, your boy boyfriend or girlfriend. Yes, 
Yes, I totally agree with you. Hey, Carmencita, do you have good friends? Yes, I have a good friends, but only a best friend. Okay, how many good friends do you have? Um, four. Okay, in my case, I got many, mm, like uh, four or maybe five, but they are good, but excellent, no one. Because I always said, Carmencita, and I don't know if you share the same opinion, but I always said my best friend is my mom. Good friends? Yes, best friends? Just my mom. Disagree or agree with me? Yeah, I totally agree with you. Mm -hmm. I think mom is a good friend for me too. Excellent. Do you have a good relationship with your mom? Yes. She always supports me in every decision or every travel that I mm -hmm. have. Do you have a good confidence with her? Yes, I Why? think yes. Why? Uh, I don't know. She's very good with me and she gives me. A... Excellent. Ok, excelente. Thank you so much, Carmencita. Miren, chicos, okay. quiero felicitarlos. Fíjense que yo, yo les iba a mandar las preguntas. Por ahí me dijeron, es que hay una confusión. Sí, por ejemplo, cuando yo te pregunto a ti, ¿eres tú? ¿Are you? ¿Eres tú un, eres tú un estudiante? ¿Are you a student? ¿Eres tú un buen amigo? ¿Are you a good friend? Y lo opuesto, bueno, no lo opuesto, lo contrario de decir, ¿tienes? ¿Tienes buenos amigos? Do you have? Entonces, ¿eres tú? Are you? ¿Tienes? Do you have? O sea, quizás ahí había un poquito, de, tal vez no de confusión, sino que como que se escuchaba igual, decía. Entonces, yo le iba a mandar las preguntas, pero ¿por qué no se las mandé? Porque yo no quería respuestas estudiadas. Yo no quería respuestas estudiadas. Entonces, ¿alguien de los que no participaron quieren hacer el ejercicio? ¿O oh, estamos claros? Everything is clear like a Lempa River. Five or yes. which exercise teacher? Exercise. Because. Excellent. Thank you, Jose. I got some questions. Welcome to your class. How are you? Hi. I am good teacher. Hey, Jose. <laughs> listen to me and pay and please okay. pay attention to me. I got some easy questions, personal questions. As okay. you know, Jose, today uh, we are celebrating Independence Day, but yes. do you like to celebrate this day? Yeah. Uh, yes, with my family and um, with my sister because I love my sister and come. Uh -huh. um, how do you say la pasamos bien? We in English? have a we have a good time. Or we spend uh, good moment. Oh, we spend good moment in the afternoon with my sister. My sister right now is sleeping. Oh, <laughs> oh my God. Tired. <laughs> my God. Okay, nice. Hey, Jose, I totally agree with you because some people believe, some people believe that celebrating independ Independence Day, celebrating Valentine's Day, it's about when you got a boyfriend or when you got a girlfriend but it is not right yeah. in my I, case for me it's a yeah. commercial day yes uh, with my business and the business with my mom is a commercial day because i how do you say vendemos or we sell we, we sell. sell a lot and for the family celebration in that's Hey, do you have good friends? Um, no, I don't like have a lot of good friends. I have only three friends or two friends. Nice. So my question is, do okay, you got two or three, but what can be the characteristics to be a good friend? Um, ¿Cómo le podemos llamar así? Okay, vos sos un buen amigo, por esto, because you are, mm -hmm. 
because the these people with me and uh -huh. um, we were uh, bad moments with me War they, we were worse uh -huh. moments with me they are always with you uh, it doesn't matter if you're sick it doesn't matter if yes. you downed it doesn't matter if you're happy or good moments right this, these people stay with me in this bad moment nice really nice and you what about you are you a good friend um yes i'm a good friend because i like mm -hmm. to help the people nice. and more my my friends that's excellent thank you so much some people thank you so much jose some people believe that to have a good friend represent according to the bible said when you find a friend you find a treasure la biblia dice que cuando usted encuentra un amigo se encuentra un tesoro esa es la definición imagínense esa es la definición de acuerdo a la bible so thank you so much Volunteer, alguien te dice yo no participé y quería participar. Five, four, three, two, one. Excellent. Thank you so much. Let's continue with the topic, the numbers. The numbers. Ok, pilas ahí, señores. Vamos a ver. Berito, activemos micrófonos. I'm going to dictate you five numbers. Le voy a dictar cinco números a cada uno. Así, randomly, al azar, se prepara Carmencita. Ok, vamos con el primero. Voy a iniciar con los básicos en este caso. No sé si mostrar la, la pantalla. Sí, la voy a mostrar de todas maneras. Ok, vamos con 15. 15. 89. 18. Ah, voy, voy, con, voy con Berito primero, Franklin. Thank you, thank you. Voy con Berito, ah, thank you, thank you. 89. 89, muy bien. Vamos con 60. 60. 60. 60, 60, 60. No, 60, 60. Ah, ok. Muy bien. Repetime el número una vez, Berito. No me lo repitas dos veces, porfa. Ok, thank you. Vamos con el tercero. Vamos con 10,020. Um, ten, no, ten uh -huh. mil, ah, ten ese es millones. Yo quiero 10,000. Uh, ten, ten thousand, twenty. Vamos con 115. 115. Vamos con 8. 18. 18. 8, perdón. 8. 8. Ok. Thank you. Carmencita se prepara Daniel. Carmencita, vamos con 12. 12. 620. 620. 12.005. 12,000. 5. 12,000. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 5. 200. 2000. 2000. 2 millones. 2 million. Muy bien. Vamos con 333. 333. Vamos con 144. 144. Daniela se prepara, Eduard. Daniela, vamos con 1000. 33000. 30,000. 18. 18. 21. Vamos con 3 millones. 3 millones. Vamos con 10,040. 10,040. Vamos con 12,020. 12,000, ¿verdad? Yes, 12,020. 12,020. 20, 20, 20. <laughs> 20, ok, thank you. Eduard, voy contigo. Eduard, se prepara Franklin, 400. 400. Vamos con 100,000. 
100,000. Vamos con 629. 629. Vamos con 11,011. 11. 11,011. 11. Vamos con 15,037. 15,000. Vamos con... Ya, 37. Ah, 33. 33, 33, 37. Ah, 37. 37, Sorry. vamos con 20. 20, 20. 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 888 900 999 13 13 vamos con 1900 100 1900 eh, one... mm -hmm. No sé cómo es. ¿Mil? ¿Cómo se dice mil? Eh, 100. Eh, 1000. Eh, 900. Eh, 900. 900. Muy bien, thank you. Voy con... <ríe> ¿Con quién? Me... Ah, Giovanni se prepara. Katia. Giovanni, voy con 400. 400. 700. 700. 1000. 1000. 5000. 5000. 66000. 66 mil. 66. No ah, 16 000. Vamos con un millón. One one million. 33 billones. 33 billion. Billion. Vamos con 11 mil. Uh, 12. No. 11. No. 11, 11, uh -huh. 11,000. 11,000, thank you. Katia, se prepara Kenny. Katia, voy con 4. 4. 17. 17. 70. 70. 700. 700. 70,000. 70. 70 70,000, 000, 000. 70, 000, 70, 77. 2022 43.100 43.000 43.100 Muy bien, excelente Kenny, voy con Marce Kenny, voy con 200 Eh, ¿cuál, ¿Cuál teacher? 200. Bueno, ahorita me pongo los lentes, teacher. <ríe> dele, pues dele. 200. Muy bien, voy con 50. Um, 50. 500. Um, 500. 525. Eh, 525. 900. 900. 913. 913. Voy con 1000. 
Voy con 33 mil. 33. Uh, 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 sería. 33 mil. Uh -huh. uh, 33,000. 33, Thank you. Marce, voy con José. Marce, 900. 900. Voy con 1000. 1,000. 42,000. Teacher apagó el micrófono. 42,000. Mm, 42,000. 55,000. 55,000. 55,323. 55,323. ¿Cómo fue? Perdón. 55,323. Ahí te lo mando al chat. Ok. 50,300. Uh, mm, no. Porque no es 50, yo quiero 55. Ah, ok, ok. Eh, uh, 55,000. Eh, se me olvidó la otra cantidad, quiero ver. 323. 323. 23. Thank you, Marcelita. José, voy contigo. Yes. Uno. One. Dos. Ay. Two. Tres. Three. Sesenta y siete mil cuatrocientos veintiuno. Sesenta y siete mil cuatrocientos veintiuno. Ahí está. Sixty seven thousand four hundred twenty one. Muy bien. Voy con setenta y nueve mil trescientos veintidós. Setenta y nueve mil trescientos veintidós. Seventy Uh, 79,322. 322. Muy bien, thank you. Let's see. Renata, <laughs> voy contigo. <laughs> es que ya son cantidades más grandes. <laughs> Renata, voy con 10. 10. Uh, 20. Uh, 20. 30. 30. 40. 40. 50. 60. 60. 60 70 70 80 80 90 19 100 uh, how on 100 100 100 100 200 200 44122 ahí está en el chat 44122 44 mm -hmm. uh, thunder thousand porque son miles uh, ah the, uh, thousand uh -huh. on one twenty two. one k one k one oh uh, Honder. One hundred, ajá. Twenty two. Twenty two. Y voy con el último. Ochenta y ocho mil Eighty-eight. Vaya, repetí conmigo. Eighty-eight thousand, porque son ochenta y ocho mil. Eighty-eight thousand. Seven hundred seventy-seven. Um. 
seven. Honda. Sorry, teacher. Bye. Repeat it with me. Eighty-eight thousand. Thank you, Renata. Please turn on your audio. Renata, thank you, thank you, thank you, Renata. <laughs> yes, but thank you. Don't. Es que te puse una cantidad super alta, hija. No, don't worry. Va, íbamos bien. Lo que pasa es que ahí te tiré de un solo una bomba. Repetí conmigo. Como yo quiero ochenta y ocho mil, sería eighty eight thousand. Repetí eighty eight thousand seven hundred. Porque quiero setecientos seven hundred. Seventy-seven. Excellent. Muy bien. Thank you so much. Okay, let's see. I'm going to finish with Miguel. Hello, Miguel. Ready? Um, uh, yes. Excellent. Okay, let's see. Vamos con diez. Ten. Vamos con cien. Uh, one, one hundred. Vamos con mil. One thousand. Diez mil. Ten thousand. Veinte mil. Twenty thousand. Un millón. One million. Okay, vamos con dos mil treinta y cuatro. Two thousand thirty four. Vamos con ochenta y nueve mil cuatrocientos cincuenta y cinco. Ahí te lo mandé al chat. Eh, eighty nine thousand eight hundred. 455. Ok, vamos con 100.000. Mm. Vamos con 100.000. Let me see. One. Ajá. 100.000. Excelente, vamos con el último. 112.020. Cien, ahí se lo mandé el chat, 112 mil 20. 112 20, dicen el chat. 112, perdón, 112, 112 mil 20. Ok. Eh, sorry, sorry. 112. Ajá. 112. Ajá. 20. Ok, excelente. Ok, thank you so much. Thank you. Gracias, señores. Ahora bien, finalizo con esta lectura. Miren, solo hay un detalle chiquitito. La confusión cuando es hundred y la confusión cuando es thousand. Hundred es para cientos. Y thousand, en este caso, es para ya miles. One thousand, two thousand, three thousand, mil, dos mil, tres mil. En este caso, es la pequeña confusión. Ok, termino ya con esta lectura. En este caso, la voy a leer yo una vez rapidito, aunque yo sé que ya manejan los números, pero creo que tenemos algunos detalles de pronunciación con algunas palabras. Por eso es que la voy a leer. No porque en este, en este caso siempre eh, pongo al alumno que él haga la lectura de una sola vez. Cuando termine de leer, si hay alguna palabra que usted no entienda, me deja saber. Hello to all of you. My name is Laura Ashley. I'm a zoologist and I work to preserve and save endangered species, that is, animals which are disappearing from our planet because of the changes in climate, hunting or poaching, and the destruction of their habitat. Do you know that one of the last male white rhino has just died? And here are some estimates for some very emblematic animals. There are only about 700 mountain gorillas left, 1,600 giant pandas, between 2,000 and 3,000 Bengal tigers, between 7,000 and 10,000 cheetahs. About 130 condors, less than 50 Amur leopards, between 4,000 and 6,600 snow leopards, about 7,000 orangutans, 
80% of the population of the white shark has disappeared in less than 15 years. 80% of the population of the irradiated dolphin has disappeared in the last 50 years. The Chinese dolphin disappeared in 2006. The giant pinta tortoise in 2012. 50% of the Asian elephants were exterminated in one century. Teacher, hay una palabra que yo no la entiendo. ¿Me podría explicar? Yes, in the fourth line, for the starting, or page. One, two, poaching, three, poaching. Or... En el caso de poaching, viene siendo igual que hunting, cazar. Cuando, pero cazar como concepto, cazar. Cuando matas, en este caso, poaching, cuando matas a, una, a un animal, a carne, a sangre fría, ya Maybe sea de un disparo. Disappearing. Desapareciendo. Ah. Disappearing. Yes. Ah. Disappearing. ¿Hay alguna otra palabra, teacher? ¿Me ayuda, por favor? Eh, yes, Franklin. La que está arriba de 2006. A 2006, 2006, sí. espérame. Abajo del todo. 2000, uh, espérame, espérame, espérame. In, 2000, ¿Qué línea es? Dice, antepenúltima one, línea, two, antepenúltima línea, teacher. At the, at, in at the last one. At, at the last one. Ah, ok, I got it, excellent. So, which one, Franklin? Thank you, José. Eh, la de encima. Irra Waiti. ¿Esta? Uh -huh. esta, yes, no yes. Es, esta no es una palabra en inglés, este es un tipo de delfín. ¿Se han, ¿Conocen o han visto ustedes esos delfines que tienen la nariz chata? Se ha fijado que algunos la tienen normal, así larga. Pero en el caso de los Irraweiri, es un tipo de delfín. Son los delfines que tienen la nariz chata. Que no tienen nariz prácticamente. ¿Alguna otra palabra, teacher, que usted mire nos puede ayudar? Porque dice que no sé. ¿Qué de eso se trata, teacher? La, la, el... el... El, ¿Cómo se llama? Que eh, la lectura, ¿verdad? Le Habla Ajá. sobre ese animalito que está en, como en extinción. Habla de todo, porque si usted se fija acá, habla de los, de los mountain gorilas, ¿Gorilla? habla de los giant pandas, habla de los bengal tigers, habla de todos sí, estos de animales chiras, ajá. Los uh -huh. chiras, habla de los yeah, cóndores, yeah. de lo, todo esto, esto es como el amo leopard. Todo, uh -huh. Esta lectura es acerca de los animales que están en peligro de extinción. De extinción. Uh -huh. Yes. Los uh -huh. Chinese dolphin, los uh -huh. Asian elephant. Todo, la lectura es basada en eso, los animales en peligro de extinción. ¿Hay alguna okay. otra duda o consulta? Gracias, teacher. Ok, you're welcome. ¿Hay alguna palabra que usted diga, no, mire, tiche, yo en este caso creo que, no sé, o todo se entiende, fine, four, three, two, one. Ok, todo se entiende, señores. La pequeña homework que les queda para el día miércoles es la siguiente. Necesito que practiquen esta lectura, que la lean, porque el día miércoles los voy a poner a leer one by one, porque quiero calificar dos cosas. Quiero calificar la velocidad. Por favor, ya no me lea. Hello to you all. My name. Ya no me vaya a leer así el día miércoles. Y punto número dos. Voy en este caso a evaluar eh, en el caso de la pronunciación de los números. Y el día miércoles, usted ya sabe cómo se pronuncian los números. Ahora, vamos a aprender cómo se escriben los números. ¿Dudas o preguntas, señores? No, teacher. No, teacher. <ríe> ok, chicos, gracias a todos Everything los que estuvieron en clase. Screen, Everything is like clear like horchata. Excellent. Yes. I like it. I got it. I love horchata too. Thank you, señores. Nos vemos el día miércoles. Have a really good day. Bye. Bye, Bye teacher. Bye, teacher.